Arkansas is gearing up for a historic moment, the total solar eclipse. It's going to be a, an event unlike no other in a long time. For the first time in more than a century, the path of totality runs right through the natural state. It's something to look forward to. And Logan County has been looking forward to totality for quite some time. With three minutes and 27 seconds of darkness expected on April 8th, officials here expect the county of about 21,000 people could see its population double for the event. With the influx of people expected to come witness this magic, Sheriff Jason Massey says preparations began a year ago. The top concern, not crime, traffic. This is a full hands on deck, everybody work. We're going to divide our county up into smaller zones and have extra deputies working so we can have them in the different communities in case traffic is so bad we can't move. Logan County EMS will also be stationed across the area. Whether you're coming out for the weekend or just the day of, Massey has some advice. You know, make sure you pack some food, you know, pack some things that might make it a, a long day and just be ready for it or it being a long day. We're also trying to remind people um, that are having private events on private property to make sure that they know that they're responsible for their land and they're responsible for what's going on there. The Arkansas Division of Emergency Management says the state is not only planning for the influx of tourists, but what may be left behind once they return home. We want to keep Arkansas beautiful and pretty and we want people to clean up after themselves too. In the county seat of Paris, Chamber of Commerce Executive Director Tanya Fletcher says they have a long weekend full of events lined up for tourists. It's kind of like having a, a mini Super Bowl in your community and so we're just excited to welcome people. We, we hope that there are people from other states and other communities that come and fall in love with Paris just like we are. And one spot sure to draw a huge crowd, Mount Magazine, the tallest mountain in Arkansas at just over 2,700 feet. Park Superintendent Sarah Keating says all 60 lodge rooms and 13 cabins have been booked for the weekend, but visitors are still welcome to view the eclipse on the mountain. Some folks will be up here camping out and, and enjoying the park in that way. So we're excited about all the activities we have planned. Months of anticipation, Thousands of visitors, all for three and a half minutes of darkness. In Paris, covering news where you live, Kayla Davis, 5 News.